new update today in Fortnite. You guys got Greasy Grow, Moisty Meyer in the prison back. So why would Ninja say it's the dumbest thing he's ever seen? He played four games and then he rage quit and he left the game. You will see this in a second. No clickbait. You know we don't do that here, but many of you guys are loving the update with Prop Hunt down in new Moisty Palms. We have tacos literally falling from the sky and Greasy Girl, but many pros are wondering what even is this game anymore and what will Epic Games do next? TSM Myth is not a fan of this. He goes off on a hilarious rant at Epic and then tons more in this video, guys, including new skins, new locations, and Rocket for Season 11, and even Nick830 showing us an OP trick you need to learn before you land in Moisty Palms. We'll see if we can pack it all in, but I am your second favorite PE teacher, Denver. Tap like right now and tap subscribe to make sure you are subbed up for all the latest Fortnite news and don't you dare buy anything in that item shop until you type in code that Denver guy YT. But let's go ahead and hop right into this and watch Myth go off on Epic for what they did to Moisty Palms and then we'll see why Ninja straight up rage quit and lost a thousand viewers instantly. Check this out. Oh, this house is going to go down. Here's this house going to go down, right chat? Hey, look. Here's how it's going to go down in a competitive set, sort of setting. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to the FCS Championship Finals. Here we have Myth. Oh my god, late game. He is a literal trash cam. Trash can. The irony is ridiculous. But here he goes, hiding in the trash can. Players zooming all around him. This is what Fortnite is all about. As you can see, Cloaksy is literally a porta potty and they're standing right next to each other without knowing a bit. Neither of them will move or shoot because if they do, it will take them out of their hidden position. Yeah, man, I know, you know, it's kind of crazy how players just have to adapt to what's been put into the game. And it's great to see these pros, you know, taking their mind and, you know, working around these interesting gameplay mechanics. Well, that's this is the new uh, that's the new mode, boys. So yikes! You can tell Myth is not super happy with it, like a lot of pros who want the game to be competitive. But is Fortnite a competitive game, guys? Tell me what you think below on whether Epic should focus more on that instead of just making it a casual game. But pro or casual game, this stuff is just weird. Like, why would they put props in Battle Royale at all instead of just making an LTM? So now we have zombies in retail, no building and tilted props here and moisty, and then greasy now has tacos that rain down and everybody dances together like what is this game anymore i'm not even against it or anything like this but listen to this post titled rift zones are stupid hey folks we at epic games like to add stupid stuff to the game that only six-year-olds enjoy wanting classic greasy grow back we got you except now it has falling tacos why you may ask well we at epic games love communication so we'll tell you we don't know why, but here you go. Have some tacos. We also had a great idea to combine Paradise Palms and OG Moisty Meyer, but we wanted to mix things up a bit, so we added Prop Hunt to the area. Have fun. Make sure you report all the inevitable bugs because we force our staff to do stupid stuff they obviously don't want to do. See ya, folks. <laughs> and of course, as much of a joke as that is, what are they thinking? And a lot of you guys want to know, uh, but Ninja, he wants to know too. Either that or he just doesn't care enough to find out anymore. As he hopped on, he played a few games, looked like he was having a terrible time. He dropped in Tilted Town eventually, got killed immediately, and then he rage quit. And he went back to WoW. And he even claimed, listen to this, he claimed Epic is trying to bomb their own game for this reason. You'll have to hear it. This clip is from Tim's stream just because Mixer is so hard to get clips from and Tim's awesome anyway. But listen to Ninja and Tim here react to why Ninja lost so many viewers immediately before we get to the new skins and locations and much, much oh more in this God. new update. Check this out. They want us to play, uh... oh my God, what's it called? Save the world. Imagine. Yeah, they want us to play Save the World, dude. They're 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 bombing the battle royale stuff so that we play Save the World. Maybe they'll give Save the World a try. Mmm, boy, love it, dude. It just got barrel stuff, and I'm getting meleeed, and now I'm hopping on WoW. Later, guys. Uh, I'm back. Everyone's dead. Nice. Wait. What? What time? Absolutely, dude. Oh, you just left? Yep. <laughs> I'm, I mean, I'm He's down. Off. I'm down for a while. You don't gotta tell me twice. Hundred percent. All right, WoW, it is, dude. Run it. Absolutely, dude. Tim, 
dude. This guy goes, the guy in my chat goes, bye. It's like, I don't really understand. Leave. Bye. <laughs> oh, I got a guy that said bye in my chat too. The yeah, great dude. Tron. Everyone. Heck I, w and wave. I just lost 1,000 viewers and counting. I don't care. True. I do not care. Preach. So Ninja can't hold back anymore. He has something else to play besides Fortnite that he's having fun with. And look how fast he leaves and doesn't look back. Like, that's scary how fast he can just rage quit because he's just had enough. And a lot of you guys tell me you're the same way. You don't even play Fortnite anymore. Like, I've been playing Ark for like a week. I love it. I don't even want to play Fortnite right now because I found a game that's actually fun and doesn't just feel like work or just because there's nothing else to play. Like, imagine if Minecraft, guys, had a huge update every week and then all of a sudden the Ender Dragon was doing the taco dance and healing in the middle of battle Plus, all of a sudden, you can no longer place blocks in the nether or something like that. Like, you would just be like, why did Mojang do this? What is the point of this? But at least you can turn into a trash can in Moisty. But if you're having fun still, then good. All these updates, they aren't meant for everyone. No one expects, honestly, no one expects the pros to be happy with anything Epic does anymore. But somebody who does try to look at things positively always is Nick A30, as most of you know. And he found out something crazy with the props that you need to know before you land here. Check this out, and then you'll see the new leaked locations and skins coming soon or in no, season 11 dude, watch what? this actually try shooting me sancho see if you can shoot past it like shoot a little bit to the left okay and i have a sniper so this is perfect nope no hit. okay wait what about uh shoot the table now shoot the table yep left right, and right shoot side the corner i'm gonna shoot the corner yep oh hit. wow okay how did you All whistle right, so by the way uh taunt or triangle oh or, wow okay I, yeah, yeah. I, whatever you're... <laughs> 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 yeah. this is good. What would be the best one to do it as? The car, dude. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, storm's coming. So besides the taco dancing, those prop hitboxes are what you see and what you can hit. So if you pick a big table or something, you are so much easier to hit as opposed to like a lamp or something really thin. Of course, you don't get to pick, but if you do find yourself as a big chair or something, try to change quickly because you are a massive target. Now, big changes to the map and more a rocket is now popping out of Dusty Depot. Check out this video from at Fort Tory on Twitter. Amazing leaker. Still doesn't follow me on Twitter, but that's fine. I'm not salty or anything about it. But if you haven't seen it yet, something big is going down. Take a look at it here. So is the visitor building this brand new rocket to try to leave again the right way or is there something else going on here? Let me know what you think will happen to this rocket in the comments below. And Amusel just said on Twitter, if the season 11 new map rumors are true, I'm hype. So keen to have that clean map feel we have back in season one or two. Just lots of fields, houses, lakes, clean. So what is Muselk talking about? Leaker and YouTuber HypeX said, what confuses me? Is these leaked POIs names? Is the whole map going to change in this event or are they for season 11? Listen to these locations. Beachy Bluffs, Camp Cod, Dirty Docks, Frenzy Farm, Holly Hedges, Lazy Lake, Mount Meadow, Power Plant, Slurpee, Swamp, Sunny Shores, Weeping Woods, Mountain Meadows. Like that is a lot of new possible locations. Are we getting an entirely new map for season 11? And if so, why didn't they just do this for season 10? Like we all expect it to happen. It would just be such a random thing to do for Epic to change a brand new map for season 11. But random things that make no sense is kind of turning into Epic's thing. So who knows what we can expect. Uh, but these places do sound really awesome. And I don't think anybody complains when we get new places to land on the map. But hey, big news for you guys who love to play in the arena and 
and you love to play with your friends, Arena Squads is coming soon, which means you and your three buds can hop in and play with Siphon, and I think this will bring a lot of pros back because players like Ninja and Tifu and others were really upset last time, uh, a long time ago when Siphon was first removed because they didn't want to play regular pub squads anymore without Siphon. And yes, we have trios, but sometimes you just want to play with four people, and I think squads will overall be less competitive than trios, duos, or solos, and hopefully we just get to see a lot more fun to be had instead of most streamers just constantly not having a good time which we see everywhere now now are you guys still playing fortnite i tried my best to politely request a player count from epic saying on twitter go follow me by the way i said can epic give us a quick update on the number of fortnite players please haven't heard a player count in almost a year this isn't a gotcha or a told you so either i want to know how many people currently play this game you'd think that would be accessible somewhere and i mean it when i say i will talk about the numbers if it's low of course but i do not want to use the numbers as some kind of like epic sucks argument or something but more of a lot of you guys say you're quitting the google trends chart is diving off a cliff still and it's at its lowest point ever a lot of us creators our lives depend on people playing this game and enjoying it so if the player count is insanely low now and they just own up to that fact publicly i think it would be a good step in being transparent with us communicating with us seeking advice from people who love this game and can help it go in a good direction what i do not want to see epic do is continue to go in a bad direction that we a lot of us assume they are hiding all the information from their creators and player base making random decisions and then before we know it the plane crashes and we're all wondering what we could have done on a game that could last i mean five ten years guys this game has the potential hope all that made sense like and sub use code that denver guy yt if you guys want to see me play some other games let me know and not because i need a new game or anything my channel's doing doing great luckily but i really want to start a new channel play some fun games and do something new besides just play a game and you watch it like i'm talking challenges big and hilarious stuff i never really liked the let's play thing so let's do something bigger all right that's it i'll see you guys in the next video love denver